Alright guys, time for the finale episode. Yay, happy music. Sort of. Let's just say a friend of a friend let me jump in line. If we like it, it's ours. Hopefully the PS3 plays PS2 games. I haven't tested that tested that out yet. <laughs> hey Dad! I think I found my room! Yay you. <laughs> well, what do you think? It's perfect, Ethan. We'll be able to forget what happened. We'll lead a normal life. And one day it'll all just seem like a bad dream. We've earned the right to be happy now, Ethan. Aww. All three of us. This is what I say to that. Aww. <laughs> 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 well, happy endings are always good. I'm still kind of like sh shell shocked, even <laughs> even now that Shelby was the killer. I mean, starting off, Shelby was my favorite character. Huh. Guess you shouldn't judge a book by its cover. Let's talk tonight! Our guest today is on the cover of Today's World magazine this week and has been hailed by the whole nation as a new hero for our times. Astonishingly, he almost single-handedly ended the sinister almost. series of killings by the man known as the Origami Killer and saved the life of young Sean Mars. His determination, courage, and intelligence have won our admiration. Norman Jaden. All right, Norman. Hailed as a hero, Blake must be, like, steaming. Oh, God. Bad music. And the trip came. Is he going to toss it or is he going to keep it? Oh shit! He's going to, he's going to toss it. Alright, so it's overall a good ending. Or not. <laughs> you never know with heavy rain. It's full of twists and turns. For all you know, Jaden could actually be the real origami killer. God, I hate that Mars setting. Oh my god, imaginary tanks. I think I smoked too much weed. Trying to see things. Wait a minute, he's not wearing the airy glasses. Oh, this is definitely creeping me out. Those ver those tanks are part of his airy glasses. Like there was a mini game involving them, right? So maybe there's some is something involving Airy and not the triptocaine, or maybe it's the triptocaine that's causing hallucinations. I don't know. I don't really get the whole triptocaine subplot. Oh, or you killed my son, Scott. Yep. Were you thinking about that when you held me in your arms? And gave me tongue. I don't know why you did all this. Nothing can justify it anyway. Right. I feel nothing but contempt for you. Nothing but contempt. Spit on his grave.
good riddance. I mean, Scott Shelby was an asshole. Even though initially I didn't think he was an asshole, I thought he was the coolest guy ever. Uh, that's one thing I'm disappointed about. I wish it was Blake. I want to see them again. I'm a father too. So guys, I hope you enjoyed my Heavy Rain OP. I was pretty nervous all throughout it, as you can probably tell. <sighs> yes, we all know you like dreaming about guys in ski masks. But anyways, obviously the commentary wasn't that good. God, I'm getting distracted by this. Commentary was not good, period. I know that. I'm just going to improve, though. Improve, though. At least that's the general plan. After this, I'm actually going to do a Heavy Rain game review, so make sure you check that out. I'm also going to be doing Indigo Prophecy, considering that it plays on my PS2 3. And, ooh, this hurts. You guys owe me so much for doing using the saw for that gruesome scene, even though I kind of overreacted. As for future plans for Heavy Rain, I'm actually thinking of, once I get my online thing working, I'm going to get the DLC, like the taxidermist, and this is way too loud. <laughs> Holy fuck! Stay back! Don't come near me, or I'll shoot! I'm just waiting for this to be over. Ugh, fucking asshole. Alright, that'll work. Anyways, I might be doing the Taxidermist DLC in any future DLC, considering I get my PlayStation Network working, which I hope I do, because I'm getting games like Street Fighter 4, um, Super Street Fighter 4, I mean. Left 4 Dead 2. So hopefully that works out. As for, I've, uh, I've mentioned co-op before with Heavy Rain doing alternate scenes that I didn't show during my main playthrough because I was just trying to get through to the end and make it through my very first LP, but I think it's still going to happen. I just got to get in contact with my friend. Once I do, I'll start taking requests after I start doing a few scenes that I want to do, that I know I want to do, and show you guys. So make sure you look out for that in the future. I'm not sure what's going to happen now, but I might take a day or two break before I actually start on Indigo Prophecy or do some Tekken 6 filler. I obviously want to spread out my time until June 1st, which is when Alpha Protocol is released, so that'll be a blast. So I'm Rio Zyken. And I hope you enjoyed this LP. Again, I thank you for watching this. I thank you for the subscribers that are interested in my Heavy Rain LP and interested in future videos I do, like Kid Mischief, Tactical Error. I really appreciate it, guys, and I hope that you will continue to watch my videos uh, that are to come. About time for me to sign off now. I'm getting near the 10-minute mark anyways. And I will see you guys very soon. And look at that. The credits are ending. Great. Perfect timing.